All right, this week we're going to be trying out a bunch of different straps on my Citizen Nighthawk. Let's take a look. So as I mentioned, this week we're going to be uh, taking a look at some different strap options for one of my favorite watches, the Citizen Nighthawk. And as you can see, I've already got it off of its um, stock metal bracelet, stainless steel bracelet, which I, I wore it with the stainless steel bracelet for a while and uh, I really enjoyed it like that. Um, but I really like to kind of play around and so I was able to pick up a whole bunch of different straps uh, on sale a little while back and we're going to be trying them all on the Nighthawk today and kind of see how they look and it'll be kind of fun because you know I think some of the combinations that I'll be looking at are, are probably not ones that you see very often um, on the Nighthawk. I've got a, a black leather rally strap for instance. I have a red silicone uh, band. Um, so yeah, so maybe a, a little out of the ordinary sometimes but we've also got some standard um, leather straps. I think the Nighthawk looks great on a nice uh, leather strap and again that's that's what I've got on now is on this kind of nice dark uh, brown leather strap. Um, but yeah, I, I think having a bunch of different straps uh, is a great way to kind of stretch your collection out. You can take a watch that's uh, more dressy and you know you can put it on a, a more casual looking strap like a NATO um, or you can and, and then you know use it in a, in a more casual style um, or vice versa. You know you can take uh, you know for instance the Nighthawk came on a, a metal um, metal bracelet, which it looks great on the metal bracelet. I really enjoy it. I like that. Um, but yeah, you put it on a nice leather band and it kind of, you know, elevates its classiness a little bit and, you know, maybe it'll fit uh, a different style looking like that. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and get into it and we'll take a look at some of the different straps. And, you know, just as we do, you can kind of consider, you know, what sort of straps you might be looking to add to your collection. And, um, you know, for me, it's, it's really helpful if, if you get watches that tend to have the same um, lug width then then you can really you know really get the most out of your strap investment um, I, I tend to have a lot of watches with a 22 millimeter lug width and so that's been really um, helpful for this and I've been able to kind of you know mix and match straps from different watches um, and use ones that I've been able to pick up but let's go ahead and take a look at the, the straps and see what it looks like all right so here we've got our lineup of straps we've got six different ones we're going to try on the watch and you guys um, make sure you leave a comment below and let me know which one you think is your favorite and if there's one that i missed that you think would look good on the nighthawk let me know but we're going to go ahead and start off um, with my personal favorite um, i really like this tan leather look now you'll notice that the hardware doesn't match i took it off of a watch with a black case so i wouldn't actually wear it like this but um, i don't have any other tan straps uh, that fit this watch um, but I really like the, the way the color uh, matches with the, the Nighthawk. I like that sort of tan leather. We have a lighter leather and then the dark black dial um, and you get a little bit of contrast there. I think it looks really um, classy, kind of a little bit of a vintage uh, look to it. And um, yeah, so I'm kind of on the lookout trying to find a good uh, band that will match the case better and maybe a little bit higher quality one. And when I do, that will probably be the main strap I will wear with this watch. So this will be, yeah, again, we're kind of starting off with my favorite. But um, yeah, make sure you let me know what your favorite is as we go through these. Let's go ahead and move on to our next strap. We have a NATO strap. Um, as most of you know, and NATO straps are typically made out of uh, nylon like this one. Um, they are waterproof. They're very comfortable. They're extremely practical. They secure the watch better than uh, most other straps out there. They're designed so that even if one of the spring one spring bar pops off, off the um, the, the whole uh, watch won't fall off your wrist. Um, so they're very practical. Um, yeah, one of, one of the safer and more secure ones. And recently, they've kind of been coming into uh, popularity because you know they, they can be kind of a little bit stylish too. This one particularly matches the Nighthawk well. It's a, got a black and gray scheme that really goes with the colors of the Nighthawk. Um, and again, it being waterproof, the Nighthawk being a, a watch with high water resistance, um, I think it matches really well. So now we're looking at you know a different NATO strap. This one is not going to have that water resistance because this is a leather one. Uh, so you're still going to get the security of a NATO strap, but this one's really more, I think, a style uh, choice. Um, I think that the the leather NATO kind of really goes well with an with a sort of a pilot style watch. I like that look, 
and the Nighthawk is, you know, definitely fits the bill for that. Um, so this, I think, kind of gives it sort of a, a vintage pilot's watch feel, even though the Nighthawk itself is, you know, maybe not quite the, your, your traditional um, old school Flieger, but um, yeah, it still looks pretty nice. I wore it on this one for a while. Kind of revisiting it though, um, I feel like this particular strap with the, the large, uh, you know, uh, you know, what is it, the clasps on the side, um, doesn't quite go too well with the um, Nighthawk. I think the Nighthawk is a little on the small side to pull this one off, but you know, that, that could be depending on your, your choice of style. Uh, so here we've got something that's totally different. I didn't expect this one to really work well, but I was kind of pleasantly surprised. The, the red on the silicone uh, band really matches, uh, I think, with the red on the GMT scale, so it kind of get a little cohesiveness there. Uh, and it gives a really nice look. Um, not to mention silicone, it's, it's, it's comfortable, it's waterproof, it's pretty solid and secure. Uh, so it's, it's an all around great um, practical band and it gives a nice pop of color on there. So I really like the way this one looked. Um, the only challenge being, um, I think for me, and you know, it's maybe not quite up, not, not just doesn't match my style of what I like to wear. This may be a little bit too sporty, a little bit too casual for what um, I would prefer. But for a lot of people, you know, this could be uh, a nice option. If you've got a Nighthawk and you want something that's waterproof, you want something that's uh, maybe a little bit sporty, a little bit more colorful, um, this actually looks pretty good and it wears pretty well. So that might be something to try. Okay, next we're going to go with another leather strap. Um, so this one is, uh, it's an olive colored strap, so a little bit of a greenish brown. Um, just gives you a little bit, something a little bit different between, be, be, uh, besides your typical brown or black leather straps. Um, again, the, the Nighthawk is it's kind of like an aviation, it's an aviation style piece. Um, kind of goes well with these sort of military-esque colors and I think it kind of matches in that regards here. Maybe not as well as like a tan or a black strap. I just feel like the, the green is maybe um, not quite meshing too well with the, the colors on this watch. Um, but it's a nice looking one and I have worn it like that to be a little bit dressy. Uh, last strap that we're gonna be looking at, this is a, a rally strap. So it's got, uh, it's a black strap with some extra holes all around the sides of it. Um, it's kind of like a, a race car inspired, racing inspired watch uh, strap uh, is what it's, I think it's originally meant for. So it's a little bit of a, a mix of styles, you know, going from the uh, Nighthawk sort of aviation style and then this being more, I think something that I would like to wear it with like a nice chronograph watch. I, if I had one, uh, I'd like to pair this strap with it. Um, that said, I think it actually kind of works. It might be a little too busy for some people's taste, but I really like it. Uh, but anyways, um, yeah, so that's the last one. And with that, we'll go ahead and wrap up the review, and head back and finish up. Okay, so those were the different straps that I have that I've tried out on the Citizen Nighthawk. Um, leave a comment below. Let me know which one, which one do you think looks the best on the Citizen Nighthawk. And you know, if you've had you know, any experience with uh, different straps, if you have a particular style of strap that you really enjoy, uh, maybe drop a comment for that as well. But as always, I hope you uh, enjoyed the video. Um, if you did, please take the time to hit that subscribe button down below and like the video. And yeah, we'll keep making these, putting them out, and we'll see you guys next time.